Hello everyone, my name is Luano Kinosawada. I'll be walking you through the introduction of our expert advisor, Martin Gale 6 Hybrid. Before beginning, I would like to introduce my mentor and product owner, Dr. Masu Sejari. On Confluence, I created a page under Expert Advisor Evaluation and Comparison for our EA Martingale Hybrid. This Expert Advisor was first created in June of 2018 and last modified it in November of the same year. The full name of this Expert Advisor is Martingale 6 Hybrid and the author is Aaron Tadzik and this is the link where you can find the code. So this expert advisor uses the simple moving average and the martingale strategy to decide how to make an order. So if it's an uptrend or if it's an open buy order, then it will be placing a buy order. And if it's a downtrend or if it's an open sell order, then it would place a sell order. Besides that, this EA can be used for all time frame, but since it's a day trading algorithm, it's better using it in the daily period. Here we have the diagrams. The first one that we have is the class diagram. And then we have the sequence diagram. And the following is a state chart diagram. Those three diagrams were designed to help you understand and have a better view about Martingale strategy. After that, we have the input variables and the explanation of each variable, and then the optimization input variables. So here we have the results for our inputs for the historical period that is from July of 2016 to almost July of 2018. So here we have the inputs that we set for the optimization and this is the graph that we get. If you click here you can see a better view of the entire report. So you have all the trades that were made Right, and the next one it's the summary for our report of the forward period where the period is from July 2018 to until the end of December of 2018 and again using the same input variables we have a different report and if you click here, you can have the entire report. So I chose this input because it was the, the best result that I got on the historical period and the best one that I could get on the forward period where the objective was to get a better profit on the historical period and then a better profit on the forward period. I tried other inputs, but they would give me a better profit on the forward period, but then I wouldn't have this smooth line here for the historical period. So I ended up choosing this one because I could get more money on the historical period and, and the forward period. Then here we have a video talking better about the research, but I'm just gonna show the page for you guys. So here is basically the research page for the Martingale strategy where I'm explaining what is the strategy, how we can apply this on the trading scenarios and uh, how we can apply in Forex and what is the problem of the Martingale. And then I talk a little bit about more specific about the moving average, how our EA, our code um, 
identify if it's an uptrend or a downtrend. And then here I have uh, a little bit of the algorithm and the results that we can get. And I put some videos and uh, on other pages where we can have more information or more detail about my research here. The video about the research of the Martingale strategy is linked on the description and in the playlist so you can watch it and understand it better how the Martingale strategy works. That was it for today. I hope you liked the video. Please feel free to email me to send feedbacks or if you have any questions about this video at lokin001 at fiu.edu or if you have any questions about the project, you can also contact my mentor and project owner at sadjadi at cs.fiu.edu. Thank you for watching this video.